my name is Jonathan, I'm from Frankfurt. Uh, I'm a member of the newly founded union Unterbau. Uh, we are a basic direct democratic union um, working um, with the organizational form of councils. Traditionally in our societies at least uh, democracy doesn't, doesn't really exist and we think that this should be changed. One of the main goals that we actually have is to say the working place needs to be democratized. The working place is um, a sphere where the people spend a large part of their life. The people should of course be the ones who decide how actually they can work, how they, how they work together, how things are being done. Um, the problem, however, is that many unions themselves are actually not very democratic, that, uh, that they have an organizational form um, where paid professional representatives are in the end um, doing all the work, and which is of course helpful and useful, but, um, but it's not something that really activates people. And it's not a model where actually the capacities of the people for democratic engagement um, are really cultivated and nurtured. So um, we think that you need an, a different organizational form, one that from the beginning on uh, tries to make people organize themselves, um, tries to activate people, try to, tries to cultivate a sense that actually we are um, capable of shaping our own affairs um, and lets the people experience that this is possible, lets them learn how it is possible. Um, and such an organizational form is what we think uh, a council structure would actually allow for. In our union we try to be working in an effective way and all the elected representatives or delegates, um, they, are, they are accountable to the basis, um, the, the basic councils who are deciding um, upon, upon the, the tasks of the union and um, they are only the executive organs, so to speak, of, of these basic units. Um, and at the same time, if they are not doing their job properly, um, then they can be recalled and a, a new delegate is going to be elected at all times. In my view, Cornelius Castoriadis was contributing um, a lot to democratic theory and actually um, uh, provides us with some very useful insights about how we should conceive of democracy. And one of the core formulations for um, what he considers democracy to be um, is that he says democracy is the capacity to decide about those things um, that are relevant for your own life um, in knowledge of the state of affairs. To decide for yourself and to be aware of the state of, the uh, state of affairs are of course the crucial elements because a lot of the um, societal um, conditions and um, relations um, that exist are very hard for people to understand and actually they are not meant to be understood by people. They are not designed in such a way that actually it is possible for people to understand um, what these um, societal affairs are. So one of the core elements um, of any kind of democratic government thus conceived would not be so much that the elected representatives take the decisions for you, because democracy consists in taking the decisions for yourself, but that actually we would need central institutions to be gathering information uh, we need to get rid of, the, uh, of this fiction that it could be a neutral task and explicitly declare that gathering information um, and actually um, informing the population about what's going on is an eminently political task. And in Castoriadis' thinking about um, how he would conceive of a, of a council democratic society, well, this would actually be the central aspect of what the government needs to do. What would need to be done um, is to, 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 to create actually organizations which are capable of collecting the relevant information and to be bringing them in such a form so that people can be well informed about what's going on in their daily life, what is shaping their daily life. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs>